does make it easy to throw a seven on a, on a Friday night, doesn't he? You don't have to worry much about the bullpen? Well, I, I mean, I don't know about that. I mean, we're just doing everything we could to do to win the game on Friday night. and uh, We're glad Gingrich's on our team, that's for sure, whenever he pitches. What's been about Caleb here over the last couple weeks that made him just keep, seems like he's getting better every outing he's having? Well, what you're seeing is what you want to see out of all of them. Right. More times he gets on the mound, he gets better rhythm and timing and throwing the fastball where he wants to and commanding a second pitch. and It's what, what you want to see really with, with everybody you run out there. Can you just talk about getting his performance today? Obviously, nine strikeouts. Look like he's pretty on point. Well, up, yeah, well, I, thought, I thought he had uh, fastball was good. Uh, I thought the changeup was good. I thought the breaking ball was, was as good. It's not every day you're going to have all three of them, for sure. Uh, he had really good fastball command today, and that's really where it all starts. Uh, I mean, and really, I mean, they, those, that team swung the bat really good last night. Mm -hmm. So you think about what he did to them, I mean, it kind of puts it in perspective on how well he threw and uh, how he was able to change speeds and uh, locate the fastball. Talk about the aggressiveness that you were asking for your base runners to do and the success that they had today. We got thrown out a couple of times, didn't we? I mean, aggressive's good. I mean, we, we'll go with that all the time, and numbers added up, and uh, we got thrown out, like I said, a couple of times. At the same time, I think uh, early it might have helped a little bit. And, uh, I mean, I think there's more there for us there in that department. And uh, I liked it. I've really liked what we've seen as far as the whole weekend, really, as far as running the bases, maybe other than, you know, a couple of things that happened. Uh, and that's probably going to happen time to time. DH declined today. Just what have you been seeing out him him lately? What kind of went into that decision? Uh, he had some. Uh, we played a little simulated game on Wednesday, and really felt like he had some intent, and he's had some intent on what he's doing. And swing seems short, and uh, you know, with as much as they mix, a uh, guy that you know can back the ball up and hit the fastball and attack a bad breaking ball, we just felt like it was a good matchup for him. Grant hadn't played since two since uh, I guess last weekend. Is, is he hurt right now? He's got a few tweaks. Gotcha. Sure does. Like to get him healthy, as fast as we can. That's for sure. I mean, he's he's uh, that's for sure. How important was it just for the series to kind of bounce back and get the, get the win today, especially in, in well, well, each, each day really. I mean, I think each day it's important that you come out and prepare the right way. I think we all feel that way, and we want to walk away. We want to play the game the right way throughout the game, throughout the entirety of the game. As far as the series go, I mean, it evens the series up because you play good baseball. And uh, I think the most encouraging thing for us is that. Uh, it was a little bit better, you know, brand of baseball today. And always that starts on the mound. I mean, when the, when it's clean on the mound and a guy's crisp on the mound, it seems to slow everybody's heart rate down a little bit and uh, play good defense. Between Gingry and Killian, those guys only gave up four base runners. Only let four guys get on the entire afternoon. How much easier does that make it for you guys to win baseball? I didn't know <laughs> that. I didn't really know that. But yeah. that really puts it in perspective on uh, how well they threw the ball and. Uh, and also kind of gives a road map for the other guys. I mean, for everybody that's going to throw tomorrow. And and really, from here on, I mean, if you just if you don't learn anything watching Stephen Gingry pitch, it doesn't seem like you're paying attention to the game. Uh, you know, throw first pitch strikes and mix in a change up and breaking ball and build pitch on both sides of the plate. He's uh, It's a clinic. What you think about how you and the rest of the guys hit today? You guys got 15 hits. What do you think you guys are seeing today? Uh, I think uh, we just put some quality at bats together. Um, it's all you can really do, you know, just try to find a barrel. And um, Buff was pretty, pretty good. Probably one of the better pitchers we've seen. But uh, felt like the guys did a good job. Josh Young really did a good job. Uh, overall, they did really good. What's it been like seeing him, especially over about these last two weeks? Seems like he's just seen a beach ball out there a little bit. Yeah, he's a he's a good kid. Um, he works hard. You, know, you find him in the batting cage probably right now at some point, but. Uh, he puts in the time, and uh, I'm glad it's showing. You know, for a couple of weeks he was lining out everywhere. You know, and it's kind of like you want something to fall for him, but he never would. And now it's uh, kind of doing it for him. So I'm glad. Good to see.
How nice is it just to have Steven the after, after coming back after a loss, you just know he's going to be on the mound and uh, yep, just six innings, nine strikeouts, short yeah, work. Just a typical day for Steve, another day in the office, but uh, he's uh, Steven Gingry now. Just, that's all you could really say. He just shows up every day, and uh, you know you're going to have a confident guy on the mound when he pitches, so it's fun to play beyond. Does it get a little boring out there when he's not giving up any hits? Trust me, no, it does not. It, uh, I enjoy that. Believe it or not, I enjoy having a couple strikeouts here and there, and uh, it's fun today. I laugh because he got me a ground ball, and he always loves doing it. <laughs> but uh, yeah, he's uh, he's good, man. He's something else. Fun to watch. What was working for you today? Uh, I mean, I'd had really good fastball command today. Um, just scoring runs early really helped me out, and uh, overall, it was a great team win for us. I think we put some really good swings together and some really good at bats. So overall, it was just really good for us today. What have you seen out of Caleb Hill the last couple of weeks at Killian? Well, he just seems like he's really come on for you guys in relief. Yeah, he's a dude. Um, I mean, he comes in, throws, throws gas, and he can uh, throw, throw all his pitches for strikes for the most part. So I think he'll be a really part of a really big part of all, our bullpen uh, later on. How important was it for you after giving that home run to have your guys come back and score? That? Do they give you that four spot? Oh yeah, that's always huge, uh, especially when we score runs early. I mean, we put. We put good swings on the ball from the beginning, so I knew we were, we were going to get to him eventually, and that's exactly what we did.